Hello everyone, welcome to Learn Reality Console. Today, I will teach you how to prepare a steady area map using ACMAP 10.7.1. Let's get started. Go to catalog, navigate the folder containing the data, and this is it. So, when you are preparing a steady area of a specific area, you need shape files of that area, especially boundary shape files of the area. So, if you do not have this kind of shape files, you can watch my previous videos on how to download GIS data from various data sources. So let's kick start to what we are to do for today. So this is the Ghana regions, regional map of Ghana. The study area is in Ghana. This is the regional map of Ghana. Let's open attribute table to see. That is it. Okay. Then let's bring district Ghana district shapers. These are all districts in Ghana. These are them. Okay. And then I'll bring in the steady area towns the towns in which uh, the study is going to be conducted so one of the study area is Siriiri bring it we have Guo bring it And this one, Boro. Look at here. These are our three steady areas. One, two, three. That we are going to conduct the research. So. Zoom to layer. Okay. So now we have to create a layer of the district in which the study is going to be conducted. So let's open attribute table for the districts. Attribute table. And now the district is. Um, Wow West Wow West and this is it that's already been highlighted you can close it this is it Wow West it has been highlighted so go to the district right click go to selection and you come here create layer from selected Features. Click on it. Layer has already been created. So let's double click on it to label to label it. Just Wow West District Assembly Assembly it has been done and then let's change uh, 
symbol ye for it and let's change so we can remove this we are no more interest in other districts so let's remove the district layer leaving only the wild west disassembly and the rest of the study area towns so let's change layer okay and these are the towns too let's change the symbology uh, the symbology let's make this red and then let's make this ginger pink Let's make this green. Okay. So at this point, let's create another layer. You go to inside and insert a data frame. That's a new data frame. Then let's drag the district here, drag the town here, drag another town here, drown the last one here, then bring the district below. These are them. Let's turn off these layers and let's click on layout view. Right click at any empty area. Click on page setup change into landscape click the ok you can also use this method file page setup it will lead you to the same thing so bring this here let's reduce it Let's reduce it. Anyway, let's zoom to layer. Let's reduce the Ghana map. Then let's increase this.
zone clear and let's zoom clear okay The arrangement seems to be okay. So let's add some of the map properties. Go to insert north arrow with this. Click on this. Then click on it again and set essence legend. Put the legend here. Then set skill bar. Good properties. zero number of divisions zero yeah kilometers divisions apply okay that is clean Okay. Let's click on it to activate the data frame. Insert legend. Try to shift this okay. seems to be okay. Set no faro. Scale bar. Double click on it. Put zero here. Make it kilometers. Divisions Okay These are basically um, most of the features of a, a map we have done all. You can also put grids if you are interested. You can right click on this, go to properties, come to grids, click new grids, next, go back. Go to divide map by meridians and parameter grid. Device map into a grid of map units. Reference grid. Divide map into a grid for indexing. So we go. 
graticals, gratical and labels, tick marks and labels, labels only. Let's go this. Go go. That's the grid. You can remove it if you are interested. No interested. Apply. Yes. Okay. See, it has been removed. So let's put title. Regional map Ghana showing steady areas. And then let's draw a neat line around the elements of the map. Neat line. Go. Great. So let's export our map to see how it looks. File. Export. Yeah, you can choose the format in which you want to uh, save the exported file PDF, SVG, BMP, JPEG, PNG, TIFF, GIF. So let's use JPEG. You can change the resolution here. Maybe 600. Then you name it try try the context of or the area you want to save it. Click on save. That's been exported. Let's see how it looks. Try. Wow, good. This is basically hard create a map of a steady area using ArcMap 10.7.1 thank you very much for watching this video and kindly subscribe to my channel thank you so much bye bye